Hello guys, how was everybody? I hope all of you is doing well. This is Travel Discoveries channel. What documents do I need to prepare for my K-1 visa interview? Please stay tuned and stick until at the end of my video. guys today i'm gonna share with you what documents do i need to prepare for my k1 visa interview while we are waiting for the uh, manila case number that the nbc will send us we need to start now preparing our documents or requirements such as our valid philippines passport our true copy certified birth certificate from the pse or philippines statistics office and also legal documents probing the termination of a previous marriage if applicable uh, such as CINUMAR, marriage contract or divorce papers and also police certificates from all foreign countries where the applicants live for at least six months starting at the age of 16 it means guy that for example before you work outside the country and you live for at least six months so you need to get the police clearance certificate okay and also the evidence of the relationship with the petitioner such as you know the court logs money grants money grants transfer if your fiance send you money and also the messages okay and our medical examination completed by the St. Luke's Medical Center Extension Clinic. Okay, we need to uh, set an appointment through online, but right now we need to wait for the Manila case number before we set an appointment. And also, the copies of the visa photographs and also the evidence must be presented that the couple met in person in the past two years before the petition was filed such as you know if your fiancé visit you in your country you need to present the plane tickets uh, hotel receipts pictures together and then if you eat in the restaurant you know the restaurant receipts okay and also don't forget to register the, to the uh, CFO the telecounseling that also and also we need to fill up the DS-160 form uh, in online okay so I guess guys that's it for today uh, and another one thing guys maybe we need to you know to prepare also the documents of our petitioner such as the birth certificate of him the passport the affidavit of support yeah, and also his naturalization if he was citizen by naturalization or you know the w2 the irs and the divorce papers yeah we need to prepare that also okay so that's it only for today i hope you get an information from me today <laughs> so see you in my next video and please don't forget to subscribe in my channel like and also share and don't forget also to click the bell button so that you know uh, if i have a new videos so you will be notified okay so Thank you for watching.